So right here on this corner, we have the Golden Computer Arcade. This is a small mall, but basically it's just full of different stalls selling all your computer necessities. The direction, the address, we'll put down at the bottom in the description of this video. But for right now, we're going to go in there to the Golden Computer Arcade and we're going to check it out. Seeing this place now, in reality, it did bring back a couple of memories. In fact, I bought from here, back in the day, a PlayStation 2. Yeah, so when PlayStation 2 first came out, this is where I bought it from. And I've forgotten all about that. And what was really cool back in the day, with the old PlayStation 2s, when you used to buy them from a place like this, they used to hack the PlayStation. So you would turn it on, then you'd push the blue button for like five seconds and hold down again for two seconds, hold down for five seconds, open the dish tray, close the dish tray, and then all of a sudden the light would flash and then your PlayStation 2 was good to go for playing pirated games. And here, I used to buy all the copy games. I used to pay, it would be $10 for 10 games, $10 for 10 games. Um, and you know what, even back then, even back then, that was still cheap. $10 for 10 games. Shit, these cameras are cool. Some cool cameras here. This, I mean, I'm, I'm vlogging right now with the Action 4, but maybe I need to use one of these. That's what I need to vlog with. That's a vlogging camera. It's a shame, they've obviously, the police have cleaned up. Yeah, I think the police have cleaned up the city a bit. I don't see any of all like the pirated dodgy stuff. And that was certainly what I used to come here and get. I'm not seeing anything like that. It's all legit now, but maybe that's the way it should be, yeah? It's so compact in here, so dense. Weirdly enough, it's a lot more nerve wracking vlogging in these places because here you start to feel conscious. Here it's kind of like, oh, uh, and I can see everyone's more looking, like on the street, nobody's been looking at me. But here, everyone's kind of like, again, they're thinking, oh, oh my God, is that Denzel Washington? Why is he vlogging? It's, I'm not, I'm not Denzel. Common misconception. Uh, I know I've used that line in another video. Every X amount of videos, I'm going to use that line. So I'll give you an idea of the prices. It is, that's a good price. You're looking at, say, I, I would buy 256 paying about $20. But it's not night and day cheaper. I can find them sometimes for the same price, even on Amazon. Ah, yeah, here we go. Here's more the console side of things. No, no photo. Okay, sorry. Let's find a good one. It's a general idea of what the prices are like. Fuck these. Old school nice. Oh, this is, this is, this is a cool computer. Check out this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a Who's Your Daddy one, is that? Hey, check it out, it's Mark Queens. Mark, Mark Queens. 
Yeah. Yeah, the PlayStation 5 games are way, way cheaper. Okay, I may treat myself. Nintendo Switch Lite or Nintendo Switch must be crazy popular over here. Because, um, God, I see a lot of that. I suppose it would be. It makes sense that it would, wouldn't it? Something you can play with in your bedroom, said the bishop to the nun. Okay, so as you can see, Shem Shopo has so many things you can see and do. It really, really is an area that captivates more than just for streets and restaurants, but it has these malls. There's also another big mall close by called the Dragon Center. You've got this electronic mall here, you've got the markets, you've got the wet markets, the fruit and veg markets. You have absolutely everything in this neighborhood. So I was just talking to the guy back then. They have PlayStation 5s for sale, the CD version. That's 3,280 Hong Kong dollars. So you're looking at about 400 euros or 420 US dollars for a PlayStation 5 CD version. Um, the only difference is it's, it's a Hong Kong version, which means the warranty is for Hong Kong only. But that's the only difference, is the warranty. If warranty isn't going to be an issue for you, then that's a good price. I need to find Mario Kart. I don't have Mario Kart for the Nintendo Switch. No Mario Kart. You know, coming to think of it, I'm starting to have slight flashbacks while I'm here. I think I even bought from here a Nintendo 64. A Nintendo 64 with golden eye. And I remember when I got it from here, I'm sure it was from here now, come to think of it. The Nintendo 64 had, um, I had like a V Doctor or something it was called, that you plugged into it and you kind of put the games from cartridge onto CD. So I ended up having like every game and every cheat code and everything for the Nintendo 64. Like V Doctor, I think it was called, or something to do with an octopus. I don't remember now, but I just remember you would plug it to the Nintendo 64 and then I could put games in 64 games. Well, I could buy CDs with N64 games preloaded. I was hoping to see some of that stuff here today, but I guess now with protection and copyright, that's a thing of the past. I have a question for you, seeing as your English is so good. Uh, it's, it's not good. It's good English. Do you have the terabyte extender, the SSD card for the PlayStation 5? Yeah, sure. You just can use any version. That one? Not sure people like that, but some people, we can choose any, any SSD. And this works for the PlayStation 5, right? Yeah. And this is a good one. You recommend this? Yeah, I recommend that one. And how much is this? Get in, eh? One megabyte is fine. One T. 980. One T. It's one terabyte. Da, 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 da. You can get better price? It's better price already. So now you buy the machine, it's very cheap price. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. You see the, oh, come back. Yeah. You just buy the machine, it's okay. Also, a question. Do you have... Mm. You have the Super Mario Kart 8? And mm. how much is the game? 290. 290. Mm. That's good. Thanks, buddy. Thank you for your help. I don't know if that's a good price or not. To me, that one terabyte upgrade is about $120. One second. Let's check it out. Let's find out. So PlayStation 5, get the phone out. That was a Samsung one terabyte PlayStation 5. Amazon selling it for $80. $80 and that guy was selling it for about $120 huh? Here it is Found on another website Best Buy $69 
So almost double what you would pay for an Amazon. That's why you can never win. Amazon wins all the time. It's the same one. Same picture, same everything. So let's find someone else and see what price they're charging. Because yeah, you're looking at that guy who's gonna charge me double the price of what you can buy on Amazon. So that completely confuses me. Although Mario Kart 8 for $35 um, is probably quite a good price. You have the SSD card for the PlayStation 5? Yes, we have the 2TB or the 1TB. The 1TB one one is 890. 890. It's like this. So there is the SRN XFTX. It's the faster than this standard. This one is how much? Two, uh, two dB? Two dB is the 1580. 1580. And for the 1 TB? 890. 890. Okay, that's a better price. And this is your last price? Yes. No, no better price? <laughs> it's the better price. Okay. With the hissing. And how much are the, do you have Mario Kart 8? Yes. How much? 280. 280, yeah? Brand new. Brand new. Yeah. The language is Okay, it's multi-language, yeah. okay. Okay, we'll get this one. We'll get this one. Okay, so I've asked around. So, whilst the SSD cards were some places really expensive, I found some places where it started to get a bit cheaper. I think I may be in luck here. I think they were telling me to get the heat sink one, and it did look like I found much cheaper ones with this company I'm about to talk to now. So, let me find someone who hopefully speaks English and can explain a bit better. Hey, speak English? Yeah? It's okay if I have my camera, it's okay? Yes. You're a handsome boy anyway, don't worry. I need the, for the PlayStation 5, mm. the terabyte thing, the SSD card. Too many choice. Too many choice, right? For example, the WD. Yeah. Yeah, that's the piece of it. It's expensive, too expensive. Yes, along with the data of the Furby, also can use on PS5. Which is the heat sink one? Uh, you must need heat sink to put on PS5. No heat sink alone. Heat sink is good or no good? You need, you need sure you need this. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hi, hi. You're looking for SSD for PS5? Yeah. We recommend this one. Samsung. But the Samsung is heat sink? Yes, with heat sink. This, this model with heat sink. Have you got anything cheaper? Cheaper. It's a little bit expensive. Yes. This one. This one works on PS5. So. But is there a difference between them? This one's better or is it same? Just brand difference. If you use on PS5, I think no difference. Just like your original SSD. Okay. Yes, same speed. And when it's heat sink, I just connect and that's it, nothing more? Yes. Okay. Just one, one step. Just one just, step? Yes. Just put in your PS5 and that's it. I like your watch. Is it real or yeah. China? It's real. It looked real. It looked good. It looked good. Actually, it's, it's, it's real. I like I like it very much. So, Kingsman Gaming, correct? Yes, this is the Taiwanese brand. Thanks. It's two terabyte. 900 Hong Kong dollars. So that's just over 900 Hong Kong is about 100 euros. Well, I'm not going to say, I'm just going to put the price on the screen. So 900 Hong Kong. This is the last price? Yes, we are selling cheap. Yeah. Not even if, if I dance for you, will you give discount? If I do sexy dance, no? Damn. <laughs> What's. Yeah, 850. What's the speed on this? The speed. I can show you here. The waist sweep. Oh, seven. seven. Okay, that's good then. 7500. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ah, can, can I get one more thing from you? I need one more thing. Yes. 
Can for my camera the my SSD card 256? The micro SD card. Yeah, the micro SD card. For your DJI. Yeah. We have. The good, the, you know, the good one. The scan we disc. Always here. recommend this. You always for, recommend scan disc here. Yeah. Yes, for DJI, for GoPro, Insta 360. And what's your best price for this? Okay, let me see. Because I bought this. Yeah, special, special. Family price. Okay. 190. Okay, that's good. Mm. 190. We're selling 228. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, that's th then you're a wonderful man. Thank you. I'm going. I'm Thank you. Is do I say doje or I'm going Which is correct? I'm mm. or doje? I think it's the same. Same, yeah. No, not not same. When someone. Thank you. Just saying, just a yeah. normal guy. Yeah. When someone gives you free, and yeah. you can say doje. Okay. When someone gives you something, you can say guy. But you give me this, so I say guy. I say, I say th doje to you because yeah. you get see, you get see me the money. Yeah. Yes. So me the customer, the customer you say. Can say the because customer same guy. This one, this thing. Okay. Thank <laughs> you, buddy. Two terabyte, which was eight hundred and fifty. So on the screen, by the power of magic, three, two, one. Bing! There is the price. So that was eight fifty. That was one ninety. Bing! The price. And I think it was two eighty. 284 Bing. There's the price. So three little items bought. There we go. Finally. Finally bought something. I've not bought anything apart from food. Finally. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you very much. Shamshu Paul.